Hi, I'm Catherine. Oh, hey, I'm Jordan. <laughs> and we're juniors. Um, I'm from Herndon, Virginia, up in Nova. I'm from uh, Norfolk, Virginia, you know. So we auditioned for Homebrew. Well, actually, I, well, so she signed us up a couple of days ago. Not a couple of days ago, four days before um, Homebrew was actually supposed to start. So it was kind of kind of spur of the moment. Um, so, you know, I love music and it's something I'm really passionate about. And I guess she knew that and she could sing very well. So I was like, hey, we could be like a dynamic duo and yeah, do it out, you know? So we decided, well, she signed us up and then <laughs> we scrambled together some uh, music and we auditioned so, successfully. I guess it would be a mix between India Ari and Ingrid Michaelson. Kind of soulful, but also indie ish, or like acoustic singer songwriter. Yes. <laughs> uh, yeah, uh, I think like for me, um, growing up, like you know, I uh, had a lot of influences from Stevie Wonder. Um, he is like my favorite. Uh, like just going on like the websites, you see like his incredible chord progressions. It's like crazy. And um, then moving forward, like to the '90s R&B movement with like Brian McKnight and uh, like Shy and all, this, all these people that are really sweet. And um, then like recently, like Pharrell. Um, and India Ari and Sade, like although they are different genres to an extent, maybe India Ari and Sade more closely related. But for when Pharrell produces, it's incredible, and I love his music. And I strive to just be a better musician and understand the theory enough. You know, for example, like when uh, there's a certain song we might do at Homebrew that all they do is play the same chord, but they're inverting it and maybe raising a, a fifth or a third or something. I love that a lot. So. A lot of different influence come to make this, and then feelings come involved later, so. Well, I just sing. Um, so I guess I've just been doing that since I was a little girl. Um, I grew up in, like, doing choir, and now I'm in acapella here at William Mary in Tenations. <laughs> Dope. Uh, yeah, they're, they're really good. Um, well, <laughs> I started playing uh, violin, um, I think 11 or 12 years ago. Um, also, I play like cello, bass, um, play guitar a little bit. I haven't played in a while, so don't, don't ask me to play. Uh, no, and then last summer, I started playing piano because everybody's like, I play piano. I was like, well, you know, I need to know that because um, you can like arrange better, make cool stuff. So I really uh, used my passion for music and learned it and picked it up and got theory done. So, yeah, and as far as singing is concerned, I started two <laughs> weeks ago. And, you know, I'm not sure how that's turning out. So. <laughs> so good. So good. <laughs> favorite spot would just be all of campus. I uh, I love just like walking around and like singing, humming to myself. I'm always just, just singing along. <laughs> <laughs> it's some good humming, yeah. That is really good um, Well, for me, um, I'm just sound between two places at the moment. <laughs> I really love Yule just because you come in here and uh, during the summer, last summer, uh, I jammed a lot with some friends and that meant a lot to me. Um, and then when I got downstairs, I discovered this dungeon of music. It was pretty sweet to have all these pianos and just kind of sitting here for as long as you want and just, you know, play around and also kind of hear other people play and them getting better and perfecting their craft. So I think I really like you a lot. So.